I want to sing a little ditty for my sweet, very short friend, Rebecca. In wine country, a group of friends celebrate a milestone birthday in Napa at this very vineyard. I've had worse days at work than this. Yeah. Okay, my friend Tara <laughs> had this made Almost for five us. Up. Almost 5-0. Oh That's good. Because I feel like anytime you're north of 40, we're basically here. North of Almost 40. So People cute. that don't know that is there's some shirts in the film where that we're wearing. It says the big 5-0. Like the characters they play, the stars have been friends for a quarter century, brought together by Saturday Night Live. Wine Country is based on an actual birthday trip they took together, and the dialogue offers a window into their world. There's a lot of blending mm -hmm. between what we actually say and what the characters say. How would you say that your definition of friendship has changed since the time that you guys first met and became friends? Has it changed? I think it's adopted all of our growth, mm. so I think it's really shaped and shifted along with us. I mean, that's really, to me, the mark of, of a wonderful friendship, yeah. something that is able to change and renew and grow. I loved watching I'm the Only One Without Children. Watching the moms in this group develop their friendship through their motherhood is a very beautiful thing to watch. And every so often I'll throw in a picture of my chihuahua or something <laughs> and just be like, my chihuahua has a cute Fairy outfit on. Babies. Her babies. So your character said that in an alternate life she would work in a crunchy bookstore yeah. in, Seattle in Seattle or Portland. Yeah. What would you do in an alternate mm. life? I'd be running a dog sanctuary of some sort. Yes, you would. Yeah. Like a, an old, stinky dog mm. sanctuary. Aww. I love books, the physical nature of books, and I would love to line books up and rearrange mm -hmm. them, mm -hmm. and then open them up and put bookmarks in them, and then just be at a quiet store and have it rain a lot. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, that's why so you really... Like you're moving yeah. to yeah. Seattle. Yeah, yeah, you're actually your character in yeah, that. I would, I would uh, I'd make pottery. Ooh. I like pottery. Nice. We can all do this. Yeah. No. For now, audiences can enjoy their work in wine country, offering a taste of what these comedic luminaries are like when they get together, both on and off screen. This one's good. What's it called again? White wine. I freaking love it.